Hello everybody, gonna show you this rose that came with my house. I believe this is the Grandiflora Camelot. Um, I posted online and that's what several people suggested, several knowledgeable people. And um, I don't think I've seen a closer match. So we are going to call this Camelot, uh, unless somebody uh, says otherwise. Um, if you think this is something else, let me know. Um, very nice uh, Grandiflora in large clusters. Uh, this spring, it seems especially uh, heavy petaled and, you know, almost looks like a salmon colored uh, Austin rose or something. Uh, blooms all in clusters, pretty big clusters. I'll show you the whole plant and the chihuahua. Uh, I'm gonna say this is five feet wide, four feet tall, probably a couple of hundred blooms and buds if we were to count them all, but don't have time to do that. Um, Camelot uh, sometimes has a little pro proliferation and when it's neat like this, I think it actually adds the beauty of the flower. Um, a little bit of ruffle, a little bit of a quartering in, in some of the centers um, on this one. Let's see. Just a super healthy rose. Um, I don't think it was well cared for in the last couple of years, but still it has just come uh, roaring back with some pruning and some fertilizer. And you can see that healthy, uh, very glossy green foliage all the way down to the ground. Repeat is excellent, uh, has some good lasting power. Uh, altogether, not, not much in the way of fragrance, but otherwise, uh, all together, just a very uh, good garden rose, uh, Camelot. Thanks for watching. Bye.